what is happening what is going on welcome to the channel so welcome back if you are a og like a but yeah what i'm going to do is blend the 4.2s out and what i thought i would do is just show you how to create fur easily in blender it's actually really easy and once you learn how to create fur you can you can do a few other things with it in a future video i'll show you ways that you can use fur to create like abstract scenes and it looks really cool so probably next video i'll show you how to do it but i'm just going to show you in this video how to create fur really easily in blender so let's jump into it so first thing you want to do is go shift a mesh and you want to get a icosphere okay then you can zoom in and you can add subdivisions probably five and then you can right click shade smooth and go s and you can scale it up a bit something like that just so you can see a bit better then what you want to do is go shift a and go to curve and look for fur so like that right there click on fur and now if you go here you'll see as where the dot is and you can see you got some stuff here you've got material you've got there and if you go here to modifiers you can see this is where your curve where your fur is and then you can see here what we can then do is let's go in here and you can see we want to increase the radius so just be careful if you increase it you can see it's going to be quite hard on your computer so you can just go back here and you can bring this down shape you can change it like that factor and then you can bring the density in which just basically creates more fur if i go here to like 2000 you can see it increases the fur makes more fur you can see then if what i want to do is click on it and then what we can do is go here to shading you can hit use nodes and then what you can do is you can change the color you can see that you can change the color let's go here and let's do this that just shows you what it looks like okay yeah. and like i said you can change the color you can make it like a green and you can change everything so it's really that easily easy to create in blender you it's like literally like two clicks and then you can select this as well and what you can do is you can go to asset browser so you can click there go to your asset browser so then what you can do is once you're in the asset browser you can go to all and you can look for the hair and you can see now what we can do is you can throw on like frizzy hair curves or like that or you can just go undo undo and you can throw on like that you can see you got a lot of different things you can change you can change it like that and you can straighten the hair or you can just add the curves back but yeah you can see it all depends on what look you're going for you can see if i go here now that's what it looks like and you obviously need to give it a chance to load and you can see it's obviously a bit too thick so what you can do is you can go back here and bring this radius to 0 0.05 and it brings it down and obviously this is quite thick here so you can always change things here then as well and the density you can bring it to like 100 so this brings it down or you can bring it up to like 500 just so you find something that looks good and yeah hopefully this video helped you it's just a quick quick and easy way to add fur in blender and yeah hopefully hopefully you learned something hopefully it helped you and yeah make sure you subscribe check out blender kit check out the patreon and i'll see you in the next video peace